It happens so fast. The coyote circles, then clamps down on Boozer's head, dragging the Cairn Terrier, who's 15 years old and 14 pounds. Literally, we're on the phone, and, you know, she just screams, like, oh, my God. And, you know, I think she dropped the phone, and so for a little while, I didn't know what was going on. Barnaby Dinge's wife ran out of their Northfield home screaming, and the coyote ran from the backyard. I looked at this camera, and I just couldn't believe it, that this coyote just came up, like, out of nowhere. This was Boozer before the attack. This was him after. He's got a significant gash on his head that had to be stapled, um, closed and he's got bite marks under his neck. Um, he's got a gouge mark in his eye. But Dinja says the tough terrier should make a full recovery and he's up to date on his shots. Coyote sightings in the Chicago area are not unheard of. Just look at these videos. Experts say sightings often increase during the winter months when young coyotes are searching for mates and territory. The family's home in Northfield is near forest preserves and they're sharing this video as a warning to pet owners. People let them outside for a minute and think everything's okay and just I think they need to know that this is what can happen and I think this video, I mean in 10 or 15 seconds your family pet can be gone forever.